Good morning, Kelly. Alan, this is Fernando, your realtor in Arizona at 11033 South Oakwood Drive. Beautiful home. I just walked through it. Really a nice home. Three car garage. Um, so I'm back, back, walking backwards so that you can see uh, street view. So this is a cul-de-sac, so there's no traffic here. There are literally, what, two or three homes in the, uh, the cul-de-sac, so yours is one of them. Natural reserve, plenty of cacti and bushes and just a nice, nice area. This saguaro cactus here probably took 20 years or so to grow. And it's a protected species here in Arizona, so don't you dare touch it or move it because you'll get fined. Um, so the home sits in a northeast position, so so the sun, the morning sun will hit you in the back backyard, but that's okay because that's not hot sun. And uh, in the afternoon, evening, you'll have plenty of shade. So let's walk to your new home. I think uh, you'll like this one better, actually, but you'll be the judge. So eight-foot entry door, really nice, similar to the one in uh, 176 Lane. And then as you walk in, you'll see a formal living area. Formal dining, tile throughout, so that's nice. You have a, so this is a three bedroom home, and this would be an office. Can't call it a bedroom because there's no closet, but this could be an office, uh, your artist room, whatever use you want to have for this room. So there's really four, four rooms. One of them can't be called a bedroom because there's no closet. So this would be bedroom number one. There's uh, laminate flooring, or actually it's vinyl flooring, but it's really nice, high, high end. Good sized room. All the rooms in this home are pretty roomy, pretty big. You can put some stuff up there. I'm not sure about that border, but you know, you can always redecorate. So, we go into bedroom number two. Again, same size, plenty of space. That's a queen size bed. And as you can see, there's plenty of room. I guess they're going on a trip or coming back from a trip or just getting ready to move. Full bath. This is uh, some storage area. Okay. Full bath here. Shower, top combo. Double vanities, okay, big mirror, uh, what else, oh, it was, this would be a closet, a coat closet, and then you have your great room, nice and big, plenty of space here, you have a uh, fireplace for those cold Arizona evenings, mornings, that really happens like two weeks in January, and that's about it. But you'll get to use it. Powder room. This one's kind of cool. So, I like the mirror. Let's go into the master bedroom, and then I'll walk you through the laundry and garage. So the master is huge. You got that bay window there, right? Obviously, these folks are pretty minimalist, so they don't, have, they don't have a whole lot of furniture, but that's nice. I like that myself. But uh, yeah, huge, huge room. I, mean, I don't know how big it is, but it's just humongous. Plenty of windows. Okay, I'll take you out to the backyard. I know you want to go out there, but I'll save the best for last. Uh, Pre-wire for sound. Where is it? Is it just one? Well, maybe not. I thought it was for sound, but it may not be. 
Uh, your ensuite is really uh, nice and spacious. You got a nice sized shower. It's not the, you know, the narrow ones. You got a nice garden tub, window there, your double vanities. Commode. Walk-in closet. So access to the attic. So, you know, not huge, but pretty big. I mean, really a good size um, walk-in closet. And it's got the, uh, the mirror doors. Okay. So, again, uh, French doors here at the entrance of the uh, master. High ceilings, uh, 10 foot, maybe more. Uh, linen closet. Laundry room, this is nice. You got a uh, utility sink. You got plenty of storage. Washer and dryer. Then you have this little cubby hole here, which is nice for your second fridge. More storage. Plenty of storage here. So this is kind of nice. They have one of those sensor lights so you walk in and it turns on by itself so overhang uh, storage access to the side of the house more storage obviously they already have packed some of their stuff so a three car garage so two st stall here third stall over there where they have all their stuff and uh, so again plenty of storage here if you have a lot of stuff to put away, this would be perfect. Let's go into the kitchen. Again, again great room, very spacious. Breakfast nook with windows looking out to the backyard. To have your morning coffee. So, Southwest style. Cabinetry. This would be nice for some bar stools. And again, tile throughout. Um, that's your cooktop, electric, double oven. And that's where they have their uh, microwave. So plenty of uh, surface space. This is nice too. A lot of people like this. Uh, a sink overlooking the, uh, or uh, you know, looking out to the uh, backyard, which is a very nice view, by the way. Okay. All right, so let's go outside. Again, uh, a big lot, almost 10,000 square feet, which is quite a large lot. And 